Good morning, good evening, or good afternoon, depending on when or where you're watching. I'm Mr. Breakneck. Welcome to the Breakneck Bricks channel. And today, we're going to be taking a look at my Lego City Crooks car carrier. So stay tuned. Alright guys, so uh, this here is my Lego City Crooks car carrier, as I said. And uh, it's uh, kind of a work in progress. It's by no means perfect. I am not a Lego designer. I'm just a uh, almost 50 year old dude that uh, likes to play with Lego and show it off on YouTube. Anyway, uh, without further ado, uh, you can notice there's one car missing and uh, we're going to get to that in a second. All right, so uh, here we are with uh, a couple of little cars I uh, designed for the uh, car carrier and for the little crooks stunt driving team that I came up with. Uh, they're back there in the background. I don't know if they like me calling them crooks. Uh, kind of looks like they're back there planning something. Anyway, uh, these are just based on the uh, little uh, four plus uh, Lego car chassis. I just threw them together quick. And uh, these are uh, meant to serve a very specific purpose. They're four wide. As you can see, they've got the the skinny wheels on them there so uh they're meant to fit on the lower deck of uh the lego city car carrier there uh and i'll show you how that's supposed to work in a minute all right so i'll uh, try and take a give you a little look here so in this lego city carrier that i kind of designed here uh, we've got these lego city style cars that fit on the bottom they're just over four studs wide with the fenders there. The top uh, layer level here will fit Speed Champions cars, you know. Uh, they're, you know, six wide, the old Speed Champions, I should say. The new ones are like eight wide now. These are six wide plus a bit because of the fenders on these. They fit up here. Uh, you can fit two up here and uh, I, uh, a small lego city style car this is from another set i did not design this it's just uh look it's a crooks car from one of the lego city sets i just figured it'd be a good addition to the little team there uh, so then on the bottom here if we can get this to work this uh, will actually fold down so you can get your car off rolls down onto the highway there or wherever parking lot what have you and uh yeah there's that you can get it to fold back up if you don't fall on your face and uh sometimes these yeah that was gonna happen of course so that happens from time to time depending on the uh um clutch power of that bottom rod there and this comes apart up here as well but overall it needs a redesign, sure, but I'm pretty happy with uh, that. In the floor here, I left a compartment that is very difficult to get at with gigantic minifigure hands <laughs> and no coordination. But uh, in this hole on the floor here, I got a room for uh, tie-down chains. Uh, yep, so there's that. And then uh, up front here, I put a spot up here for some tools, just some wrenches, a little wrench in there, you can see that, old school wrench, and uh, I'll get these cars off of here, yep, and like I said, that folds up, these fold up, as you can see, I don't have the trailer for it, or the, uh, sorry, the tractor for it, I just based it on the scale of the uh, gigantic Lego City uh, Lego truck. It looks like there's a criminal attempting to hijack that anyway. So we'll just throw him right on there like so So you can see what it looks like with a tractor on it And so the whole idea was you know I, there was a Lego City set that came out recently That had a car carrier in it similar to this a little smaller. I think it only held about three cars and uh, as I was building this, the black and red color scheme kind of came together. 
And uh, there's another Lego City set. Well, a lot of Lego City sets, actually, that give the crooks kind of a black and red sort of theme. So I figured, hey, why not? We'll make this uh, a, uh, like a hijacking type uh, rig that, that the Lego City criminals can use. So the idea was, uh, you know, if you're uh, the type of person that, that happens to just live their life a quarter mile at a time, like this guy down here might, sorry about that, I don't know if he reminds you of anyone, he certainly reminds me of someone that would live their life a quarter mile at a time, uh, anyway, so this is one of my sort of homegrown, homemade Lego City uh, uh, crooks that I've come up with, there's plenty in other sets, I have a whole collection of Lego City crooks that I'll be, uh, uh, <laughs> implementing at some point into my city and more more on that later so the idea is your crooks would be driving this down the road you're some innocent person driving your Dodge Charger or your Mustang so the idea is <clears throat> you would have a couple of uh, these crook type people as you're driving along the highway box you in you know the uh ramp comes down they force you on the truck slams on its brakes up you go and you're stuck another crook gets in behind you nowhere to go right and uh, that was that, that's that. And the same thing goes for the bottom. Where you can uh, force, uh, force two people in, even though there's no drivers in these cars. You get the idea. Up he goes. Quite difficultly, he will roll up those ramps there. There he goes. All right, we're going to edit that part. And nicely edited. Uh, there you go. So you end up with... Uh, your crook's up on the car carrier. The ramp stays up at the back there with the chains. You can shorten those or put shorter chains on. I'm definitely going to mess around with this in the future. Uh, but uh, for a first attempt with a couple of redesigns as I was building, I'm, I'm pretty happy with the way this is. Uh, stay tuned because uh, more coming up in the future on that Lego City Cargo Depot. I'm still working on clearing a space big enough to film that without having a mess in the background. And uh, yeah, we'll be back with uh, that in the next video, hopefully. And a little bit more of an update on this uh, whole Lego City Crooks team I got going on here. Uh, got big plans for that. So stay tuned. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.